This is Data Specialist Sanders of the Ongoing Data Redundancy Project. SCP-233, Object Classes Keter, Special Containment Procedures. SCP-233 is to be kept within a cubicle vanadium-lined container, dimensions 23 by 23 by 23. The unit of measure is irrelevant. A 23-meter safe zone is to be established around the object. No Class D personnel older or younger than 23 years of age are to be allowed within the safe zone. For optimal results, Class D personnel with birthdays falling on the 23rd of the month should be used. No firearms other than those chambered for special purpose .2323 caliber rounds are to be allowed within the containment chamber. Shift changes will occur at 23 minutes past the hour, with the final shift change occurring at 2323 Greenwich Mean Time exactly. Under no circumstances are redacted millimeter ammunition, Class D personnel born in the month of redacted or on the redacted or 20 redacted of the month, or any redacted sighted object to be brought within the 23 meter safe zone. Personnel are cautioned to take special care at redacted minutes past the hour, especially redacted hours, as this is the time period during which the object is most active. For best results, the 23 meter safe zone should be cleared of all personnel during that time period. Description. SCP-233 is a 23-sided polyhedron, each face being made up of both an equilateral triangle and a straight line simultaneously. Because of the space-time altering nature of the object, the exact physical makeup of the object cannot be emulated in three-dimensional or two-dimensional form. SCP-233 has the unusual property of altering the laws of mathematics in its vicinity, causing rounding errors to occur unless calculated using a base 23 system. Mathematical calculations carried out in base 23, however, have the benefit of being carried out at 23 times the normal speed. For this reason, destruction of the item has been postponed pending possible integration into data expunged. The difficulty of converting binary information into base 23 mathematics aside, the device has already shown its value to the organization. See Report 234 Redacted by Dr. Nana Redacted regarding her unusual solution to the unified field theory. Unfortunately, SCP-233 appears to have a particularly violent effect upon occurrences of the number redacted, occurring within its safe zone. See Report RE Death of Dr. Nana on Date Redacted. Chemical breakdown of the affected object proceeds at a rapid rate. Direct contact results in immediate destruction of the object in question by breakdown into component atoms within 0.23 seconds. One note, SCP-233 appears to be triggered not by the actual physical properties of the object in question in any empirical sense, but by the perceptions of nearby observers. For instance, it is safe to handle SCP-233 using a 2.74 meter long pole, so long as no observers within the danger zone perceive said pole as being redacted feet in length. The reason for this is unknown, but the observer effect recorded in classical quantum physics may be involved. See Report 77 Heisenberg. Addendum 233A. Upon the recommendation of Dr. A. Clef, the research committee has petitioned to redesignate this object as SCP-2323. Although this would place the item outside the standard numbering scheme, SCP-233's mathematical nature requires that utmost precautions be taken regarding all numbering schemes involving data related with the project. This was dramatically illustrated during Incident Redacted, during which the object's accidental contact with a redacted volt battery used to power a personal music device caused an approximately redacted thousand percent increase in the object's range of effect to 232.32 kilometers, resulting in deaths of the entire home team at a nearby AAA League baseball game, said game being at the top of the redacted inning at the time, and the destruction of all computer files containing information on SCP-233's interaction with the number redacted. For the safety of all personnel, future reference to the number redacted in conjunction with SCP-233 is to be avoided at all costs. Addendum 233b. Under no circumstances are pregnant female personnel to be allowed within the safe zone. 